You're with BBC World News with me, Nick Gowing. I have the headlines for you. Libya's state news agency is reporting that the interim Prime Minister Ali Zadan has now been released after he was seized by a gang of armed men at the hotel where he lives in the capital, Tripoli. The United States says it's suspending a large part of its military aid to Egypt until it makes credible progress towards free and fair elections. It comes as three Egyptian soldiers and one policeman are reportedly killed in a suicide attack on the Sinai Peninsula. Health officials have reported a worrying rise in cases of bubonic plague. Madagascar registered 256 cases and 60 deaths last year. Many more are thought to go unrecorded. And scientists say they've now made significant progress towards a treatment for conditions like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. A team from Britain has for the first time shown that a chemical can prevent brain cells dying. You're up to date.